Hello everyone, welcome to Road Trips with Roadrunner Rich. We will be in the ghost town of Nelson, Nevada. After checking out the lake, we started heading back to the ghost town and we saw this old mine. So we stopped and checked it out. It had a lot of graffiti on I wish people wouldn't do that. This cave tunnel is all graffiti out. Take a look and see how large those pillars are. The camera does no justice for how big this mine really is. Welcome to the ghost town of Nelson, Nevada. After uh, checking in with uh, Front, I talked to the owners who gave me permission to go in this barn that's normally closed. So let's go in and check it out. Back in 1775, it wasn't even called Nelson. It was called El Dorado by the Spaniards, who made the original discovery of gold in this area. That is now called El Dorado Canyon. Hundred years later, the prospectors and miners of the day took over and established notorious Ticacup Mine. The town of Nelson produced several million dollars in gold, silver, copper, and lead. As I was walking up these steps, I realized how shaky these were, and the wind was howling through this old barn. I was back here about 15 years ago. When it was open to public. Old rickety building. It's windy. It feels like it's gonna blow over. Nelson Mines, Nevada. This area is usually closed to the public, but I talked to the owners and they said I could come up here.
This is the area looking out towards Lake Mead. Windy, super windy. I just love this place. Look around at all the artifacts from mining to old cars. Apparently you can have weddings here. They take photo shoots. Also a lot of famous movies were filmed here. Check out that old bus. That's pretty cool. I mean, look at this place. This is one of my favorite stops close to Las Vegas. This is the front office here where you check in. They also give uh, tours of the mine that's nearby. You buy, need a call one day ahead of time to make a reservation. They also have a little museum in there with a movie and gift shop. The owners of this place are super nice. If you ever a chance in this area, stop by. It's worth the trip. Check out that old motorcycle. Somebody made out of scrap. Pretty neat. Apparently you can also rent the barbecue areas. Bring the family up here and have a big barbecue. I think I want to do that one of these days. Check out this old water truck. Just the way the area is and the cactuses and amongst the old vehicles. Quite a few years ago, I came up here and took a bunch of photos. Ham's beer. My dad used to drink that stuff. I don't think it was very good though. These relics over here. Check out all these old vintage cars. Thought I'd take a peek in this one. The seat was a little chewed up, but it was all intact. Look at the wire tire, that's pretty neat. This place is definitely scenic. Ooh, check out that car. That'd be cool if it was restored. Engine's still there. Take a peek inside. Yep. Seat's gone. A lot of rat droppings. And the muffs, roof's missing. That old fire truck in the background. I think back beyond here is where they have the weddings, that little wedding chapel they have here.
Look at the tow truck meter from the movie Cars. That's an old one there. <laughs>